Greetings everyone, my name is Cataclysm again, and welcome to my first playthrough of something that isn't Terraria. And I've already punched my microphone. We're off to a good start. So, welcome to Billy's Bust Up, a pre-alpha game that you can currently only get on Patreon. But, this is a very closely related game to A Hat in Time, but a bit more musically based. You see, every single boss, as far as I'm aware, has its own musical song number and all of the attacks and everything else merge with the song. So if a certain key and a certain thing is said in the song, the same thing will correspond to the fight. Which is fantastic, because rhythm games are... Well, they're always a good bit of fun if you can get the timing down just perfect. I mean, take Beat Saber. That's kind of a rhythm game, and... Well, look at that! Fantastic game! Anyways, without further ado, let's begin, shall we? Select difficulty, normal or hard? Well, I know you're all going to kill me for it, but uh, I think we're going to start in normal mode because uh, probably don't want to start in hard when we don't know what we're doing. And, uh, <laughs> you saw that, right? You saw that little hand coming out of the ground? I get the feeling that's not meant to happen. Press any key to play. Where's the any key? <laughs> And here's our main character, for some reason buried underground, but we're not going to question these things. And we get a little pet fox. Hello, buddy. You got your own little set of wings as well, aren't you adorable? And you orbit around me depending on where the camera is. Hey. <laughs> Can I do anything with this? I... I just... How do I do it? I break every game I touch! How do I get home? <laughs> there we go. Okay, we're good. Right. Well, let's get exploring, shall we? Oh! Oh! We've got a bit of Minecraft going on in here as well with our wooden sword. We've got an adorable little pet flying fox. And our main character appears to be a goat. Well, I should have known that. I did see all the. I did see the majority of all the spoilers and other things like that. Let's get some understanding of the control. Spacebar is jump. That's typical enough. And we collect little bells. And the bells basically act as a guide to our next location. Fair enough. The double jump doesn't appear to be a double jump. It seems to be more of a hang time thing. Look at that rock up there. All it takes is one little tap, and that thing is falling down. I do hope that's going to be part of something. Now, I know the bells are over there, but what if, is there anything on the other side? I doubt it very much. Look at that rock. That rock is balancing balancing something superbly. Can I get to it? Is that something I can interact with? No invisible walls! Glorious. Look at that! <laughs> Look at the balance on that! Well, it's worth a try. Ah, I can do a little twirl. Oh, uh, oh. <laughs> Is this out of bounds? <laughs> I don't think I'm meant to be down here. <laughs> I've, I've broken the game already. <laughs> I love breaking things. Well, this is nice. But what's with the gigantic yellow box underneath me? What is that giant yellow box? I've got an umbrella! So I have a shield, but it's basically an umbrella. Well, alright! Oh, oh, bloody hell. Wait! Well, I guess... Oh, look at those ears go! Ah, oh, I lost it. <laughs> the ear appears to be a little bit janky there. Come on! Whee! Anyways, back to where we were supposed to be. Nothing to see here? Just some floating grass! I guess someone had a bit of a mistake with the drawing tool, eh? You know, I appear to have branched off from where I'm supposed to be going, but, uh... At the same time, I can't help but explore Shh, no, There's no way this is not meant to be here. And that... Ooh, more stuff down there. Do we have more secrets? What around here? Nope, nothing here. What about here? 
Uh, nope. <laughs> I've gone outside the world again. I wonder what's here. Why on earth is there a fence here? I love breaking games, even though I didn't break it. It's just the fact that it hasn't got any lamp put on it, but who cares? <laughs> There's that big yellow box again. What is that? No, oh, here we go. So now I can be on the box. A great big yellow box. I'm gonna guess that this is <laughs> something to do with the Unreal Engine. Some sort of flat plane you can stand on. I get the feeling this might not... <laughs> this, is this is brilliant. How, about, how much further can I go? That is a big jump. I don't think I can make that. Oh, no! Come on! Jump! No! Oh, there we go. Whee! And here we go. Back to where we are. Alright, whatever. So we have a lunge attack that we can go lead into a bounce. Well, we all... Oh, this is how we get around. Everyone knows that rolling and jumping is the most effective way of getting around anywhere in a... Uh, game, isn't it? Very snatcher looking. Hello. This is beautiful. I love its design. I can see a little bit of ambient occlusion going on there, I think. Ooh, now do we go to the left or do we go to the... Well, I think we're going to the right because for starters, there's a big old chest there. And there doesn't appear to be anything else in this that room anyway. Oh, I'm gonna guess the uh, guy up there. That's this. That's his home. I'm guessing from the artwork. Although I do remember them mentioning he was an owl. Wait, 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 wait! Hello, a minute! What the hell? I recognise you. Well, you cheeky little buggers! They knew what they were doing. They knew. Anything to interact with? Very interesting P PNG flame right there. Scroll I can't interact with. Oh, so that's how we get health back. We get little berries. Hello, is that? I don't... I swear that face is familiar to me, but I can't put my put my finger on it. Although from the facial design, it does do like some sort of Sesame Street Elmo deal. You, on the other hand, I have no idea what this could possibly be. But we all know who that is. Look at it! They knew what they were doing, it's clear as bloody day. And then we have some very fine art right here. Well, off we go. Awesome. They knew what they were doing with the hat in time reference. A goat in time! That's what we've got here. We've got a goat in time. And a chicken nugget. A glowing chicken nugget. The best kind of chicken nuggets. Wait. Wait, did I just do a triple... Wait. Jump? Oh, bugger. Or is the book bouncy? Oh, the book is just extra bouncy. Alright. For a minute I thought there's some sort of one, two, three big jump. Oh, we got a little climb as well! I'm gonna have to understand this platforming. <laughs> so we need a bit of a wind up, and then a jump! And then a wind up and a... Ah, oh, never mind. It's already started, even my fox looks a bit disappointed in me. Come on, it's not that hard to do a jump. Maybe. Why are you not doing the jumpy jump? Am I am I not supposed to do the rolly jump for this one? Okay, fine, fine. All right, we've done. We're we're good. Oh, are these books gonna fall? Nope, they're just gonna bounce. Fine. And we've got cutscenes as well in thirty frames a second, from the looks of things. A little further, you got it. Uh, use your tail, little foxy. Never mind. <laughs> Hang on a minute, can't you fly? Trying to steal my stuff, are we? Well, that's not very nice. Depends. With manners like that, I should just kick you right out. You're unfashionably early anyway. The party hasn't even... Party? I'm not here for a party. I'm here for the jam. Oh. Bloody hell. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Well, well, you're alive! You're not dead at all! 
Not yet. <laughs> You're making me nervous, guy. You twisted my wing. You came all this way after all. It bewildered me to turn you away, wouldn't it? Oh, you even brought your plus one. Put me down. I told you, I'm not here for some stupid party. Stupid? How dare you? Parties are incredible. That was a long way down. How did you survive that? Oh, bloody hell. Your enthusiasm inspires me. There is one token fee to get into my party, however. The question remains, would you like to be stabbed, strangled, crushed? Oh, how about poison? <laughs> That's always a good one. <laughs> what are you talking about? Well, you don't expect to join us like that, do you? With that pesky mortal body clinging to you like a leech? No, 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 no. That just won't do. I love his voice. Jesus. Oh, we got. Oh, here we go. Oh, bloody hell. So I'm now I'm in control. I'm sure it is. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> no, bloody hell. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> no, bloody hell. Uh, bloody hell! Jesus! Oh, bloody hell, sideways! Hey! You're way too slash happy with that thing! Whoa! Thank you! Bloody hell! Ah! Whoa! <laughs> well, at least we now know I can swim. That's a nice thing. Ah, you got me as well. This is glorious. No oh, bloody Nora. I think I was already buried alive, considering I started the game in the ground. Bloody hell. Uh, oh, hey! <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm good. Bloody hell! Well, bloody hell, that would probably do it. <laughs> 10,000 volts! Bloody hell. There. This is way. Hang on, if this is normal mode. If this is normal mode, what the heck is hard mode meant to be? I've got to see that later. Oh, and we're sideways again. My favourite. Way. Not. Yeah, the bloody hell! Don't blame me, it's him, he's trying to do bloody Bloody hell, top down perspective. Bloody Nora, where did you come from? Ah, bloody hell. Wait! Hey, a gluten overdose from too much bread, is that even possible?
Hang on a minute. That, 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 that felt very Family Guy familiar, that one did. Oh, it's... It's over. It's over? Is that it? Turns out there's actually another demo of this game, so I'm going to play it as a part two. Yeah. Is that it? Well, I guess we're going back. Is that it already? We're going back to hard mode then. Let me out of this coffin. Coffin tomb. Blech. How did I even get here in the first place? I have the same amount of health in hard mode, so nothing's changed there. Let's get back to the boss and see what happens. This is so charming. I love its art design. Look at it. Hello, what's that all the way up there? Wow, this grass would get out of my way. Right up there. What is... That's a massive bloody castle. Now we've got to climb all the way back up there to get the gem. That's very chicken nuggety. Or a piece of amber. My, con my question is, why do we need it in the first place? And you've got wings, Foxy. Why can't you just fly to the gem? Would you like to be stabbed, Well, personally, mate, if I did want to go out, I'd go out big. I'd probably go skydiving with a shotgun, blast it while I'm in the air to end it all, and then just let the showers of my remains spread out <laughs> and attack everyone below. It'll make a massive inconvenience for them, and it'll piss everyone off just one last time at me. Anyway, so what's hard mode got to offer to me? As far away from you as possible! Bloody hell. Ow. <laughs> I'm not seeing any differences just yet. Can't get me with the dynamite this time. Okay, you got me with the dynamite. Oh, damn it, you got me with the spikes again! I'm struggling to see what the difference is here between hard mode and normal mode. Unless nothing's actually been integrated yet, but it seems exactly the same. But who cares? This music is fantastic! Don't miss it. So, where's the alligators this time? They're right behind me. Hi. Same amount of fireballs as well. Volts of electricity. Yeah, where's the difference? I'm not seeing any difference here in hard mode. There's a million gruesome ways to die. I thought I'd try the guillotine. This is brilliant! And we're sideways again. At least we're not upside down. Wait. Yeah, I don't think there is a... Oh, jeez. Whoa. There we go. I don't think there is a difference between e uh, normal mode and hard mode here. I'm not seeing it anyway. I like how that pillow protects you from the knife. Oh, 
If my death is going to be second to none, I don't think being suffocated by a pillow in the night is an adequate death to be talked about. And up. Oh. <laughs> the sudden cut from being upright on the head to down. And that's it. Damn it, I want more. I want more. God damn it. All right then. Well, that's a Billy bust up pre-alpha. I guess we'll be seeing more when it ha when uh, more comes out. But until then, goodbye everybody. <laughs> until the next time. If you're wondering where Terraria has gone, don't worry. I'll get talking to that event. And if you're wondering where Terraria has gone, don't worry. I'll be talking about that one eventually. <laughs>